Six Flags, New Orleans. One of the creepiest and long-standing remainders of Hurricane Katrina that devastated New Orleans and the surrounding areas is the 140-acre abandoned Six Flags amusement park. The park was originally called Jazzland, but it was then taken over by the Six Flags Company. It was opened in 2000. For a few years, things seemed to be going pretty well for the park. But then in August of 2005, Hurricane Katrina breached the six-foot earthen berm surrounding the park and overwhelmed drainage pumps. As a result, the park's attractions were left flooded under seven feet of highly corrosive water for a little over a month. Most of the attractions during this time were completely destroyed, with absolutely no chance of recovering them. The park has been abandoned ever since. Of course, leaving the park abandoned for so many years has created some pretty creepy scenes, as well as some downright dangerous ones.